hello guys uh, welcome to the channel and hope you had a great day today in this video i'm going to review with you the oro microphone uh it's uh, the mu910 microphone set so now i'm speaking to you through the microphone as you can hear there's a big difference between my sound before the microphone and after i connect the microphone i generally use a cam microphone and my cam has really good cam but the microphone is not professional as to use a broadcasting microphone and in this video i'm going to use the wind foam to remove any proximity effect So now I'm speaking to you after I add the wind foam, which I prefer to use the microphone by this way. So let's talk about the specs of the microphone. So the microphone is 16 millimeter condenser microphone and it has cardioid polar pattern. The frequency range of this microphone is from 30 Hertz up to 16 K Hertz. And this is a really big range. I know some people will say we hear from 20 up to 20 K Hertz. Yes, this is what you can hear, but this is not what you can produce from your mouth. Generally, as a human speaker, we speak from 100 Hertz up to 3 K Hertz. And the 3 K Hertz is like for female professional vocal when they are going to scream, they produce that frequency but generally when you speak you produce around 100 and you're going to hear the first and the second harmonics which is 200 and 400 so generally what we go what you are hearing most of the day is around 500 hertz so um, with that big frequency range it will capture all the sound that you are going to produce if going to sing or you're going to speak it will be totally fine with that big frequency range and also it has a 70 dB signal to noise ratio, which is really good noise cancellation. As the noise cancellation is one of the important things for the microphone. So let's hear what the noise that you can hear from my room with a microphone and from the camera microphone. So you can get an idea about the difference between the microphone and the camera microphone. So I will be silent and switch between the mic and the camera cam mic. So as you can see, there is a big difference between both of the microphone. Now I'm going to type on my laptop keypad and let's see the sound that's coming from the keypad while I'm talking to you. So let's type on the laptop keyboard. So now I'm still typing on the keyboard while I'm talking. So while I'm talking, you can't hear any background noise from typing or from the laptop fans itself. But when I stop talking, you can hear a little bit. And believe me, the fans from this laptop, it's really loud because it's a gaming laptop. So the fans are really loud. If you are a gamer, you will understand how the fans are loud in your laptop. One of the applications that I would like to use this microphone for is to record my classic guitar. Uh, I was looking for, to get a classic guitar microphone and it was like, like three four times of this price of this microphone and that microphone will cost 60 euro i will say the ones that i really like it was like 220 euro but uh, when i compare the sound between this one and the other one with the price effect i found this one is a winner 100 percent so even in recording a classical instrument or some any musical instrument i think this one is doing a great job relative to the price so let's hear a little bit of the music and please don't judge my music just about the microphone that we are going to judge in this video so let's hear some music <laughs> So hope you guys uh, enjoyed the sound of the guitar, not my play. 
So anyway, so this uh, microphone is a USB microphone, so it contains its own analog to digital converter. And uh, the specs of uh, the analog to digital converter, it's sampling rate 192K Hertz and 24 data bit. Most of music, which is really required a good quality, it's recorded on 44.1 or 48. Uh, the microphone can support from 44.1 up to 192k and that's really professional thing there is no any noise coming from the analog to digital converter a lot of the usb microphones they have a noise all the time because of the analog to digital converter and the communication with the laptop so it always has a, a noise but this microphone is amazing and that there is no any noise i would say zero noise from the analog to digital converter so um this microphone will cost you as i mentioned before 60 euro so my personal opinion um, 60 euro with that quality of the microphone it's totally good deal i would say it's even amazing deal my personal opinion for this microphone is totally recommended product and i'm encouraging you guys to give it a chance and try it if you're looking for a broadcasting microphone or recording an instrument with a usb plug and play and a budget friendly microphone this one is really an amazing so give it a try and hope you'll enjoy it also so thanks for watching and see you in another video ciao